And welcome back. Here's a live look outside the Valley News Live Storm Team Skycam Network shot in Fargo with partly to mostly cloudy skies across the Southern Valley, but staying dry, a little humid out there, but temperatures not, uh, not near where they should be. About five degrees below average as of right now. It's 77 degrees into the Fargo area, 77 also at Detroit Lake, some lower 70s out toward Jamestown and Valley City. And once again, the Northern Valley, one of the warm spots with more sunshine today with lower 80s in that direction upper 70s into the Devil's Lake Basin and upper 70s and lower 80s across northwestern Minnesota. The winds pretty light around 3 to 10 miles per hour from a southerly or southeasterly direction and we are seeing uh, mainly uh, cloudy skies especially into the southern valley out toward the Jamestown area. A few more peaks of sun from Devil's Lake just off to the south and more sunshine into northwestern Minnesota and we are dealing with some showers right now. Every once in a while we could get a rumble of thunder, but it looks like most of the thunderstorm activity is staying north of the international border north of Roseau. Showers stretching back down toward just off to the north of New Folden. Some showers into the Kandu area and points off to the west. Some isolated shower activity is going to be possible as this uh, front makes its way through. Other than that, it is pretty dry. Behind the front, we do have a cooler northerly flow and more high pressure in charge of our forecast, which will give us more sunshine as we go with, uh, into the day tomorrow. So here's the hour by hour forecast. We will have a chance of some isolated showers and possible rumbles of thunder, especially in the northern valley and the Devil's Lake Basin. The activity will weaken and dry up as it moves off to the south and temperatures falling back through the 60s with partly to mostly cloudy skies during the overnight period. And there's that northerly wind and more sunshine as we go through the day tomorrow with highs once again a little cool for this time of year into the lower to mid 70s. We're mainly dry until your Sunday evening when our next rainmaker will make its way through. You can already see it at around midnight appearing on our map. So through the day tomorrow, mainly dry with partly cloudy skies turning mostly sunny and a high of 76 degrees up and down the valley. Uh, into the mid 70s tomorrow, lower 70s as you make your way out of the valley as uh, we will stay mainly dry until the evening. This is around Monday at midnight and you can see our next batch of rain making its way through mainly cloudy skies, periods of rain as we go through the day on Monday and most areas not getting out of the 60s for high temperatures and the chance of some rain will last as we go through the afternoon and through the evening and possibly into Tuesday morning before it finally makes its way out of the viewing area. Here's the photo of the day. It's called Mom and Calf at Sunset in Starkweather, North Dakota. Thank you to Koi for this one using the background of the seven-day forecast. And for the day on Sunday, mostly sunny to partly cloudy, still a little cool at 76 degrees and periods of rain through Monday, only making it up to 69 and then 70 on Tuesday. We get rid of the rain, more sunshine. And uh, with the drier conditions Wednesday and Thursday, temperatures warming up mid to upper 70s and mid 80s on Friday as we have another chance of some showers and thunderstorms lasting through Saturday and then it'll cool us back down into the upper 70s. A pretty cool looking week for the most part. Yeah, it looks good. Uh, enjoy your Sunday. More sunshine tomorrow and temperatures through the week are not going to be hot like they could be this time of year. All right. Well, thank you, Justin. Mm -hmm.